Guys, guys, guys! I'm gonna teach you how to propagate a plant. What am I doing? I'm cutting a plant. Why? For propagation. So a symbol of propagation, you need to make a cut of the parent plant. So basically how your parent plant looks is how your plant, your baby plant is going to look like. So I go for something a bit younger, not too mature, and then I just strip the bottom leaves off so that I can get a more exposed stem like this. So after you get the cutting of the plant, you want to put it in water or you can pot it directly in soil and then wait about 5-7 to seven days for the roots to start growing. So sometimes while waiting, you see that the plant droops down because it's been cut from its life source. You want to make sure that it's not too droopy. If it's too droopy, just throw it away because it just means that the plant is not strong enough. So this is an example of a plant that has rooted. You can see like the baby roots that's coming out of here. Yeah, that means that your plant is surviving! Once the root grows, you can actually pot it in soil and then you'll just the roots will just continue to grow bigger and then that will be a successful propagation. So here are two plants that are usually more successful during propagation and that's mint and Italian basil. So when you see us around in your workplaces, do feel free to come and ask us for some trainings if you want to try propagating your plants at home. And if it's successful, do tag us on our social medias when you post it. Try it out! Thank you for watching! And I hope you've learned how to propagate your plant.